Victor, uh, you didn't win today, but I think it's like if you won because that was a real stra team strategy today with yourself and Tom in the breakaway. It was really well fought. Yeah, um, I was on altitude camp in, uh, about two weeks ago. Thomas was training in Calpe, and uh, I was looking to the to the profiles of the of the stages, and I sent to Thomas. Second stage, we have to attack in the beginning, eh? there's no choice. And uh, he said, okay, we're just gonna go full gas from the beginning and the guys that stay with us, they will be strong enough to uh, to be in a good break with us. And we, we just uh, went full, full gas all day. Um, and uh, after three, three hours, I was totally empty, but Thomas is so, so fucking strong. Uh, and he was so confident he could uh, he, he was going to win today today and also when we entered the local lab uh, and I saw so to his body language for me it was over but uh, I was also sure the peloton was not coming back for Thomas anymore you seem, you seem really impressed by your teammates we, we saw him already at Vuelta Catalunya he is impressive that's true I did last year also an attack in uh, Catalonia with uh, Thomas uh, so I know how strong he is, but today I have to say I was <laughs> I felt super strong and I did everything to make the gap as big as possible. But uh, he was just like twice as strong as me. Uh, so uh, it's, it's really impressive. You were not scared when you saw there was only uh, two guys with you, three at the beginning, but then one at the mechanical. Because this morning we talked with Thomas, he said that if there was only three guys ahead, it will be not enough, but finally it was. Yes, we went just full, full gas. I think it was most of the day headwind, so it's not easy for a break. Um, but when I see to the to the watts I pushed, I know uh, in the in the peloton uh, it would be very hard to catch us. And um, yeah, it's, it's super super uh, satisfying that uh, we can uh, top it off with the race. Also, Thomas said uh, I've won already. Uh, 10 World Tour uh, stages, uh, but not in Romandy. So it would be very nice to win one in Romandy. I said, I'm going to do everything to help you. Uh, one word about yourself. You are training for the Giro, where you have big goals, I think, for Jerusalem, the TT. It was a good workout, I guess, today. Yes, I came uh, to Romandy uh, with the goal to go full gas in every stage. Uh, so today was really a full gas stage for me um, and uh, tomorrow is a climbing time trial, it's not my specialty. I'm going to ride with the TT bike, just 30 minutes all out and then, uh, then I go home, recover for the Giro and I should be ready for Jerusalem. Thank you very much, Thank you. congratulations.